Okay, I want to move on to our third client, and that is Mark. And Mark walked in with uh, just sort of a wardrobe repeater, his children were calling him, because he had to wear certain clothes every day because he couldn't have anything tight around his stomach area. So Mark, if you'd like to explain to our viewers. Sure. Um, when Dennis just said uh, everyone should be able to live free of pain, that's what brought me to ARP in the first place, mm -hmm. watching one of your shows, I think back in January. Mm -hmm. And somehow, after 18 years, that struck a real chord with me. Uh, I had kind of what I thought was muscle and nerve damage just out on the sides of my, kind of my belly button. Mm -hmm. And uh, for 18 years, kind of a constant dull aching pain and had to wear basically elastic shorts around the house and pants and to not have any pressure. And uh, any pressure, you know, like a seat belt or, and certainly I haven't worn jeans or anything in 18 years, but any constant pressure would, would kick me up to like a seven, eight in pain automatically. Uh, so uh, sent Dennis an email and, and got accepted into the deal and, and it's been terrific. Uh, I was amazed that what I thought was my pain mm -hmm. was really where the, the where it ended, mm -hmm. and it wasn't the origin. I was amazed. I've actually been amazed by a lot of it, and and how it was treated. And I've been through the the ten treatments, and right now I don't have when I press on where I've had pain. I don't have pain there anymore. Mm -hmm. Now as I go on with with the continued therapy, I actually have some discomfort, but I think it's from the, from the recovery that my muscles that I, in my core, what I describe as my core, mm -hmm. I haven't used anything for so long. And uh, I think as I continue to strengthen muscles to absorb the shock, I, I continue to improve a little bit even more. Mm -hmm. uh, so no pain, um, pressure on my stomach is, is much better. I've, I've been hitting golf balls. Mm -hmm. uh, I couldn't do set up. Well, actually, I probably could do 10 set ups and then be sore for three or four days. I'm doing daily sit ups and crunches and using the ARP. Uh, so it's, it's, been, it's been pretty amazing. So. You're actually going to get that six pack. I hope so. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and Dennis? When you met Mark? Well, when I met Mark, I mean, we selected Mark, and we selected all these folks because of a very unique circumstances. Uh, mm -hmm. You know, they stood out, and, and uh, we felt that we could help them. And when I uh, read Mark's uh, story, it just, it sounded like, this is a piece of cake. Mm -hmm. How could he possibly go through this much difficulty over these many years? with this situation and I, I, Jay and I looked at each other and we said, how long do you think it's going to take? And I said, a minute? He said, uh, I'll give you a minute and a half. <laughs> we had the ARP on and uh, showed Mark that where he thought the problem was, was where it was ending. And uh, all that was happening is that the nervous system was completely shut down and he wasn't able to contract those muscles to do what they're supposed to do. Yeah. So we got him back in balance and you, you remember, uh, how we moved your legs very easily and then uh, put you back in balance. The minute that happened, muscles start working. Yeah. You know, if we turned all the lights off in here, nobody's going to see anything. Mm -hmm. And we try to put light bulbs in, they're not going to work. Right. You got to have the current on. Mm -hmm. This current was off. Yeah. It's just that simple. Yeah. Um, That's great to see you it, doing one of your favorite sports, then again, golfing. It, it was terrific. I, Dennis sent me, I think it was after about the sixth treatment. He knew that I enjoyed golf, and uh, and he said, "I want." He said, "I want you to go hit some golf balls." <laughs> and he gave me this regimen of, of hitting so many golf balls, mm -hmm. and, and go until you don't until you have pain. Okay. And I went over uh, to a local uh, indoor dome and and started hitting, and I, I I probably hit golf balls for 40 minutes without any pain, and normally I would be in pain or I'd fatigue very easily. And that was, I did it just by myself, no one else. Uh, that was a, that was a uh, pretty terrific uh, experience for me to, to be able to have been doing the treatments, have Dennis say, you can do this, go out and try this. 
and uh, and and I did that with no pain. And I, I've since been hitting golf balls, and it feels it feels great. Yeah. Well, we're really happy for you as well. Thanks. So congratulations on that. Okay, we're going to move on to our next candidate. That's Dean. And you were picked also through Dennis and the doctors with Jay. So we'd like to hear from you, Steen. Okay, well, um, when I was 16 years old, I had what was called transverse myelitis. It's basically a virus in my spine. And um, it paralyzed my legs pretty much. And uh, I slowly got a little bit of return. And in the years following that, I spent a lot of time um, playing wheelchair basketball, wheelchair softball, doing a lot of activities. And basically... Um, collected a lot of pain, especially sitting um, in my knee, and and I've got um, be, because I'm not a complete spinal cord injury. I'm incomplete. That means that you know I've got sensation, certain amount of sensation here and there, spotty sensation. But and so I could feel a, a lot of aches and pains. And I went to the ARP wave mainly to. Um, try to get rid of my pain so I could sit more and be a, a lot more productive in life. Mm -hmm. um, and as I read up and, and started doing the ARP wave, I, I saw how it, it did all this, all these other things like it, it helped muscle spasticity and it helped atrophy and everything that it, it talked about was besides the pain. And so I just raised my hand and said, Hey, I'd like to try this. Uh, and so I started doing it and, um, all of a sudden, I got some some activity down in my toes and my ankles and my calves, and all this activity was happening. It was, you know, my legs were just a buzz, mm -hmm. and um, it was very, you know, each each treatment was kind of a new and different experience, and it was kind of fun because um, I, you know, I re you know totally forgot about everything except trying to move my feet, trying to move my toes. And then, you know, one day, just about a week ago, I woke up and went, you know, I don't have any more pain. Wow. And so that was the kind of unique situations that I, would, I, I totally forgot about, about my aches. Mm -hmm. and, and, um, and so I, you know, I realized that it's working in, in many different aspects. Yeah. Well, even in sitting in your chair, you were having back pain and your knees and, yes. you know, with having to be wheelchair bound to be in pain all the time and just was not a good quality of life. It was not. No. So Dennis, if you'd like to comment on Steen and his progress as well. Well, once we, uh, we saw Steen's uh, medical history mm -hmm. and uh, once we met Steen, Jay and I both thought that, uh, see, Jay and I look at things totally different as you probably already know. We don't look at what's in front of us. We look at what we see at the end to be. Mm -hmm. I see Steen running. Oh. So for me to, you know, have him feel things in his feet and everything, mm -hmm. that's great. That's the, that just tells me that we're on the right track. Mm -hmm. uh, but I see him, I see him running, and, okay. and there's no reason he can't. Um, all we're doing basically is allowing him that opportunity. He's going to do a work, and we're going to do work for many, many years to get there, but we'll get there. Mm -hmm. That sounds great. And what do you think of that, Steen? Well, I'm all for it. <laughs> <laughs> what can I say? L let me loose. Mm -hmm. okay. I'll go. Yeah. That sounds great. Uh, Tim, he's our fifth client. You came in with some hip issues, and one of your favorite yeah. sports, of course, is soccer. Yeah. So you're limited on going out and doing one of your favorite things as well. So would you like to talk to us about your treatments and what's done for you? Yeah, um, yeah. I'm. Uh, I've always been a very active person, very athletic, and uh, actually, just sitting here, my problem seems very minor compared to everybody else's. So I'm kind of humbled mm. here, but um, I think it goes to show the value of the ARP it can cover so many different things. Mm -hmm. um, I simply just had very, very tight IT bands, which caused some um, very sharp piercing pains in the hip flexor muscles and caused them to kind of shut down and. And uh, um, by playing the sports in a weakened condition, it just caused some further injury. So mm -hmm. like everybody else, I, I came in here hoping to alleviate the pain and uh, get back to a condition where I could enjoy the things I do and uh, get back to a pain-free pain lifestyle. Mm -hmm. And uh, I'll tell you what, the very first session, I was just like, wow. Right. The next day, mm -hmm. I'm moving again. Mm -hmm. 
and uh, since then we've just been building on that, and it, it's been it's been amazing. Mm -hmm. yeah. And uh, hope to continue with it and uh, solve the, the problems that that Dennis was able to diagnose, and uh, mm -hmm. just just move on and live a little happier and freer and pain, pain, pain free. Yeah. yeah. And see, that's what it's all about. I mean, everyone on this stage has a God-given right to be able to move freely without pain. Unfortunately, so many people that listen to this and so many people that come into the facilities have been told that they have to live in pain for the rest of their life. You have to take this medication and live in pain for the rest of your life. That's utterly insane. Mm -hmm. I mean, if you accept that, then you've accepted it. Uh, you know, the expectation, our expectation is that you can do anything you want to do. At any age, you should be able to do anything you want to do. And that seems like a grandiose statement, but the bottom line is if the nervous system is firing the muscles correctly, then you can do anything you want to do. The skill sets are going to be there. To have a guy at, at Tim's age not be able to play soccer, not be able to play volleyball, to have Mark not be able to play golf, to have Steen not be able to run, to have Ginny not be able to have a, a life that uh, is full of activity at her age, to have Elaine not be able to exercise for 40 years. Mm -hmm. We pick these people out of, uh, you know, hundreds of people. I mean, this isn't like a hand-picked crowd of, of people that, that we thought we could help. We believe we can help anybody. Mm -hmm. So it's so gratifying to hear and understand they had to go through a lot of effort to get what, where they're at right now. This is not easy. But if you're willing to get out of that mode of, oh, I have to live with this, mm -hmm. You know, we can we can coach you out of that whole process, and they're living examples of it, and it, it's it's great. They all did exactly what I asked them to do. Mm -hmm. Henceforth, they have the results. The only people that don't get results are the people that don't do what we tell them to do. And I think a lot of people would be willing, so willing to do what they did to get back to oh, you know quality of life. Yes, they just need to know, and that's why this show is so important. Like you said, knowledge is power. Mm -hmm. They just need to know that it's available. You know, then they can make a decision. I mean, people say, why do you do what you do? You know, we send out an ARP out to somebody. We don't even know them from Adam. We're sending a $15,000 piece of equipment out to them, mm -hmm. to their house, to prove to them that we can help them. We wouldn't do that if we didn't think we could help them, obviously. That would be stupid business. Mm -hmm. And you've got to experience this. I, I could talk to Mark until I'm blue in the face. Had he not experienced what he experienced, he'd have never believed what he went through. Yeah. Same with Steen, same with Elaine, same with Jenny, same with Tim. You cannot articulate what this does. You've got to experience it.